holiday on the sea. Pepper and George are on a cruise ship holiday with Granny and Grandpa Pig. <gasps> We've won a big boat on the sea. <laughs> <laughs> there are so many things to do on this boat. What do we do first, Granny? I think we should have breakfast. Ah, but would that be a mermaid breakfast or a dinosaur breakfast? <gasps> dinosaur! <laughs> this is the Dinosaur Cafe. Morning! Would you like some dinosaur breakfast eggs? Dinosaur breakfast eggs have spots on them. <laughs> Ahoy there, sailors! My name is Pirate Pete and this is Mrs Mermaid. Please come to our fancy dress show tonight. We'll all have lots of fun. Oh, yes. We should go to the show tonight. But before that, what would you like to do? Trampolines? Splash pools? Mini golf? No, no, no! Why not just try them? Everything on this cruise ship is free. Is it really? Yes, except the ride on potato. Ooh. George wants to do the ride on potato. <laughs> potato! Good. You stay here with George. Pepper and I will find something else to do. <laughs> Trampolines! Yippee! Here is Rohan Rhino. Hello, Pepper. Hello, Rohan. Do you want to play in the mermaid splash pool? Yes. Let's go. <laughs> Granny. Oh, have you finished bouncing already? Maybe that's enough potato for one day, George. Potato! Potato! Oh. <laughs> this is the mermaid splash pool. <laughs> this is fun! <laughs> that's it, George. I have no more coins left. Oh. Hello, boys. We need to get ready for the show. It is showtime on the cruise ship. Everyone has dressed up to watch. Ooh. Good evening, boys and girls. I'm Pirate Pete. I sailed around the seas and treasure was my wish. But nothing did I find there except a great big fish. Oi, I'm a mermaid, not a fish. <laughs> Do you want to come look for treasure? I don't need to. I've got a magic box. Ooh. It will give you whatever you wish for. Just say the magic word. Which is? Uh, oh, I've forgotten. Sorry, memory like a fish. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows a magic word? Abracadabra! What? A candelabra? <laughs> no, it's not working. Mrs. Mermaid, can you check the box is not broken? <laughs> Oh, Abracadabra! Ooh. Look at that! Chocolate coins for everyone! <laughs> but wait! My new friend, Mrs. Mermaid, has gone! <gasps> Who can help me magic her back? Me! I can help you! Aha! Come up on stage! <laughs> What's your name? I'm Peppa Pig! <laughs> So, Pepper Pig, what do we do to get Mrs. Mermaid back? Say the magic word! Abracadabra! Ta da! <laughs> and that is the end of the show! Good night, everyone! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a wonderful day. I can't think how it could be any more special. <laughs> ah! What was that? It's a whale! Wow. wow! She's saying night, night! It is bedtime on the holiday cruise ship. Tomorrow will be another day. Bowling! Grandpa Pig and Grandad Dog are taking Pepper, George and Danny bowling. Grandpa, what is bowling? Well, Pepper, I can't really say. I've never done it before. This was all Grandad Dog's idea. Bowling is fun. Try not to be grumpy. And even you might have a good time, old man. Old man? You're older than me. <laughs> 
Grandad Dog and Grandpa Pig are the very best of friends. Welcome to bowling. Please take off your shoes. Sorry, for a moment there I thought you said we had to take our shoes off. <laughs> That's right. Shoes off and hand them over. Everyone has to wear bowling shoes to go bowling. My goodness, what a lot of fuss for a little game. Have fun! We will! Right, this is our lane. Danny, can you show everyone how to bowl? Yes. First, you take a ball. That's right. And can everyone see the pins at the end of the lane? Yes, we see the skittle things. I use this ball to knock those pins over. Two <laughs> <gasps> <You> fell down. <laughs> Good shot, Danny. It's like magic. Bowling is actually quite fun. OK, it's my go. My goodness, they all fell over. Yes, that's called a strike. I'm really beginning to like bowling. What's charming is how simple it is to play. You just roll the ball and it knocks over the skittles. Yes, but not to worry. It's only a game. That's a spirit, old chap. Not everyone is good at games. My go! <laughs> oh, this is too heavy. Pick another one, Pepper. Oh, this is just right. They all fell over. A strike. <laughs> well done, Pepper. Yes! And that was the first time you ever bowled! Wonderful! Now it's George's turn. Try this one, George. <laughs> and for George, I think the ramp would be a good idea. <laughs> Mike! Well done, George! Yes, well done. But how come George gets that ramp, thingy, and I didn't? Because the ramp is for little children. <laughs> yes, Grandpa. George is little, but you are big. Yes, of course. My go again. <laughs> strike! Well done, Danny! Brilliant! I think that means we've all had a strike. Uh. Apart from me. Oh, yes, I'd forgotten you didn't hit any. <laughs> Have another go, Grandpa. OK, I'll try, but I can tell this is really not my sort of thing. But I suppose what matters is not the winning, but taking part. <gasps> Strike, Grandpa! What? That was an amazing shot! Did you see that? I knocked all the Skittles over. Hey, everyone! Stop what you're doing! I've got a strike! I've got a strike! I've like got you a said, strike. it's the taking strike. part, not winning, strike. that matters. I got a strike! <laughs> Bowling is really fun! It's brilliant! Bowling is probably the best game in the world. Ever. <laughs> Grandpa Pig loves bowling. Everyone loves bowling. <laughs> Undersea party. It is a lovely sunny day. Pepper is feeding Goldie the fish. Mummy, how old is Goldie? Well, I think she must be almost a year old. When is her birthday? Let's see. Her birthday is tomorrow. Can Goldie have a party? Oh, um, perhaps we can have a little party. Daddy, Daddy, Goldie's having a birthday party. A party for a fish. That's fun. I suppose it will be an undersea party with starfish, treasure and mermaids all in an amazing undersea world. Oh, <laughs> yes. It will be the best party ever. Oh, oh. <laughs> Daddy Pig, what have you done? It's just a game, isn't it? We're not really having a party. Well, yes, I think we are, and it's tomorrow. Oh. 
I see. OK. Keep calm, don't panic. We'll just get some help. Undersea party. Here we go. Undersea parties. Brought to your house by Miss Rabbit. Sounds good. Click here and I'll be straight over. Hello. Wow, that was quick. How many days have I got to plan this party? It's tomorrow. No problem. You go to bed. I've got this. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. Good night. Right, let's get to work. <laughs> it is Goldie's birthday. Miss Rabbit has made an amazing undersea world with shells, seaweed and big waves on the walls. You did all this in one night. It's unbelievable. Happy birthday, Goldie. <laughs> oh, who can that be? Well, you said it was a party, so I invited everyone. Happy birthday, Goldie. <laughs> Hello, Penny. Hi, Peppa. This is Penny Polar Bear. I never been. To an undersea party. Bye, Penny. Have a lovely time. <laughs> I've made costumes for everybody. You can be a mermaid, Peppa. Thank you. And here is a crab costume for George. Pinch, pinch. I am Susie Octopus. <laughs> I'm Mandy Shark. Squeak. But I'm not a scary shark. I only eat cheese. <laughs> Penny Polar Bear is a penguin. Yeah. Danny Dog is a pirate. Aha! Rebecca Rabbit is, um... I'm a fish finger because I love fish fingers. <laughs> I'm a sea captain and Edmund is a jellyfish. I'm not convinced this costume accurately represents a jellyfish, but I'm not going to spoil the fun. <laughs> You all look brilliant. Is everybody ready for the pirate treasure hunt? Yes, yes Miss Rabbit. The first clue is I swim along with a giant tail. I'm the biggest fish in the sea. I'm a shark. Almost. I have a giant tail. I'm a whale. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Biggest fish in the sea is a whale. Actually, a whale is not a fish, it's a mammal. Edmund Elephant really is extremely clever. <coughs> OK, last clue. I'm buried treasure and X marks the spot. <laughs> Here it is! Hooray! Well done! You found the treasure! It's teeny tiny. That's because it's for a tiny fish. Ah, this is for you, Goldie. <coughs> Happy birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Goldie. Goldie loves <laughs> undersea parties. Everybody loves <laughs> undersea parties. <laughs> Her friends have come to the trampoline park. I never bounced on a trampoline. I bounce lots. It's the best thing ever. <laughs> Welcome to the trampoline park. Miss Rabbit is in charge. When you bounce, you must bounce safely. Yes, yes Miss Rabbit. Rabbit. First, take your shoes off. <laughs> <laughs> Only one person on each trampoline at a time. Always bounce in the middle. And no clever tricks, just bouncing. It looks fun. Yes, really fun. I might even have a go myself. Happy trampolining, everyone! <laughs> Trampolines are for little children. These are the trampolines for big children like us. Now we can do really big bounces. Pepper and Rebecca are doing big bounces. <laughs> I love bouncing. <laughs> I think I 
I'll have a go. Hey! hey. <laughs> Look, Peppa, your daddy is on a trampoline. <laughs> hey. Are you sure that's a good idea, Daddy Pig? I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I want to go too. <laughs> and me! on the trampolines. Bounce, 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 bounce bouncing up so high. high. Bounce, 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 bouncing in the sky. Mummy Pig is bouncing really high. Bouncing up so high. Not too high, Mummy Pig. Bouncing in the sky. Oh. Mummy Pig has landed on top of a tree. Oh, how do I get down? Don't worry, Mummy Pig. We'll rescue you. Uh, we'll call Miss Rabbit's rescue service. Hello, trampoline park. Oh, the emergency telephone. Hello, rescue service. Mummy Pig is stuck in a tree. I'll be right there. Miss Rabbit to the rescue! My goodness, this is embarrassing. Yes, it's the sort of thing that normally happens to me. Don't worry, Mummy Pig. We'll have you down in no time. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. Hmm. I can't land on the tree. I know. I've got a really good idea. Oh, where's she going? Whee! She's bouncing back into the sky. Here I come. Whee! Wow! This is unbelievable. Yes, it is one of my more amazing rescues. What happens next? Who knows? That was lucky. I forgot the helicopter was here. Hooray! Thank you for rescuing me, Miss Rabbit. Just doing my job. Next time, don't bounce quite so high. Yes, Mummy. If you bounce on trampolines, you must bounce safely. Thank you, Peppa. I'll remember that in future. <laughs> Peppa loves trampolines. Everyone loves trampolines. Mountain climbing. Today, Peppa and her friends have come to the climbing centre. Grumpy Rabbit is in charge. Hello, children. Today, we're mountain climbing. Ooh. Is it difficult? Yes. But it's fun, too. I've climbed many mountains. Have you ever got stuck? Yes. Once I was climbing a mountain and I couldn't go up or down. What did you do? I called Mountain Rescue. They came and saved me using a helicopter. Oh, Dad, not again. Sorry. Rescue by a helicopter. Brilliant! Yes, but that won't be happening today. We haven't got mountains. We've got climbing walls. We call this one Mount Snowden. It's just like a real mountain. Apart from the fact it's little and made of plastic. Ah! And you're going to be wearing safety helmets. <laughs> <laughs> what are the bobbly colour bits? You use them to put your hands and feet on, like this. Wow! Who wants a go? Me, please. Like this. Very good, Pedro. <laughs> Which bobbly bits do I use? Any colour you want. OK, I'll do yellow. Susie Sheep is climbing using the yellow bobbly bits. Pepper is using the blue bobbly bits. This is fun! George, would you like a go? <laughs> George has climbed to the very top. Well done, George! My little brother is the best at climbing. <laughs> that was our little climbing wall. 
Now for our big one. May I present Mount Everest? Ooh. Mount Everest is very high. Yes, which is why nobody climbs Mount Everest without a safety rope. If I want to stop, I simply come down gently on the rope. Ooh. Who wants to go first? Are you sure, George? <laughs> Remember, you can come down any time on the rope. <laughs> George is climbing Mount Everest. Wow! Oh, my goodness! That is high! George has reached the top. <laughs> Brilliant climbing! Oh dear, George is a little bit worried. Hang on, George! Mummy's coming! Stop! You can't climb without a rope! It's against the rules! No time for rules! I have to rescue George! <laughs> Mummy's here! Do you feel better now, George? <laughs> George is not worried anymore. Good. Down you come, George. Well done, George. <laughs> Hello. What about me? How do I get down? Hmm. For you, we will have to call Mountain Rescue. Hello? Mountain Rescue, please. Oh, Dad. You're not stuck up a mountain again. Not me. It's Mummy Pig! She's on Mount Everest! What? The actual Mount Everest? No, the plastic one! I'll be right there! <laughs> Hang on, Mummy Pig! Mummy Pig is rescued! Hooray! Mummy, was it fun being rescued? Uh, it was kind of fun, I suppose. Mummy Pig <laughs> loves mountain climbing. <laughs> Everyone loves mountain climbing. Good tractor. Pepper and George are visiting Mrs Badger's farm. Pepper, George, can you guess what you'll see at the farm today? Dinosaur. <laughs> no, George, there won't be a dinosaur, but there will be a tractor. What's a tractor? They're like cars with big wheels, and they can drive through mud. I love tractors. It is a traffic jam. Come on, get a move on. Beeping won't make the cars go any faster, Daddy Pig. We just have to be patient. Oh, what's blocking the road? Mrs Badger is driving her tractor. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. Hi there, Mrs Badger. We were just talking about tractors. Pepper and George have come to see your farm. Oh, good. Follow me. Here is the farm. Danny Dog, Pedro Pony and Susie Sheep are visiting too. We'll pick you up later. Have a nice time. Bye-bye. Hello there, my lovelies. Hello, Mrs Badger. No, before I show you the farm, I'd like you all to wash your hands. <laughs> wash, wash, wash your hands, wash them nice and clean. Bubbly, 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 wash them nice and clean. <laughs> Very good. Now, let's have a look at my tractor. Isn't she a beauty? Yes, she's lovely. She's got big, chunky wheels. And a strong engine to pull things along. The tractor is pulling a trailer. Hop in, everybody. Let's go for a tractor ride. Hooray! <laughs> Here is a field of long grass. The field is ready to be cut. You wait here and watch. I put a cutter on the front, a baler on the back, and the tractor does all the work. The tractor is cutting and making bales. Wow! Job done.
done. All thanks to my tractor. The trailer is joined to the tractor again. On with the tour. <laughs> it's very muddy here. Will we get stuck? No. Tractors are good at driving through mud. <laughs> and now we're going to drive along the road. Thank you for your patience. Mummy and Daddy Pig are coming to pick up Pepper and George. Oh, no. We're stuck in a traffic jam again. <laughs> like you said, Mummy Pig, we just have to be patient. Or maybe we could take a shortcut. Uh, are you sure this is a good idea? I know what I'm doing. Mummy Pig is taking a shortcut. Uh -huh. No traffic jam for us. This is brilliant. Oh, I think we're stuck. Look, that's our car. Do you need help? No, thanks. We're fine. Um, we might be a little bit stuck. Perhaps we could use some help. Of course. Hold tight. Hooray! Thank you for rescuing us, Mrs Badger. Don't thank me. Thank my tractor. Oh, yes. Thank you, tractor. Tractors are the best. Pepper loves tractors. Everybody loves tractors. <laughs> Pepper and her friends are going to a roller disco. <laughs> I love roller discos. Me too. Why you <laughs> Madame Gazelle is in charge. Keep going round and round in a circle, children. <laughs> Pepper and George have their roller skates on. Would you like me to walk around with you both, holding your hands? No, Mummy. We are good at skating. <laughs> Pepper and George love roller skating. <laughs> Whoa! Are you OK, Emily? Yes, Daddy. I'm fine. <laughs> Simon Squirrel and Belinda Bear are doing the music. They are big clap, children. Clap, clap. <sighs> I wish we could play something grown up. Clap, Belinda clap, Bear clap. is nearly ten years old. What should we play next? The wheels on the bus, please. Oh, I can't seem to find wheels on the bus. Look, there it is. Ah, uh, thank you, Madame Gazelle. Wheels on the bus go <sighs> round, round, huh. round This music is so babyish. The wheels on the bus go round and round. Round Hello, and round. Hello, Mummy and Daddy. Hello, Hello Pepper. Pepper. Wheels on the bus go round Hello, and George. Round. Hello, Daddy. Hello, Emily. This is fun. It's the first time I've been to one of these things. How many times do the children go round? Uh, hundreds and hundreds of times. Ah. <laughs> the children love going around in a circle hundreds and hundreds of times. <laughs> Hello, Daddy! Hello, Peppa! <laughs> Hello, George! Here is Susie Sheep. <laughs> Come on, let's skate together. <laughs> Freddy Fox is going the wrong way. Look out, Pedro! <laughs> Everyone goes the same way so you don't bump into each other. <laughs> Hello, Daddy! <laughs> Hello, Peppa! <laughs> Hello, Mummy! <laughs> Hello, Mandy! Hello, Daddy! Hello, Emily! Hello! Uh, hello again, Pepper. Hello again, Daddy. <laughs> hello again, Emily. What a surprise seeing you here. <laughs> All day long. Now that baby music is finished, we can play something good. I've got just the one. Can we have one potato, two potato, please? <sighs> 